Hey friends, what's up? Well, this was my last uh, shopping trip at Target for the week of the, you know, the sales cycle that's ended on the 29th of October, which was Saturday. And uh came home late. I almost didn't upload it, but I'm going to share it with you guys anyways. Um, I'm going to say that these are dead deals. I'm not sure which ones are still going to be available for the upcoming week for the same price, you know, um, at Target. But I could tell you that um, the rebate, the cashback offer for the bush beans is still available on Checkout 51. The cashback offer for the wet ones is still available on, che on um, Ibotta. <clears throat> Excuse me. The cashback offer for the Ritz is still available on Checkout 51. And the cashback offer for Ibotta for the to on Ibotta for the Tostitos and the Pepsi. <coughs> Excuse me. Is still available. Only problem with the one with the Tostitos and the Pepsi is the fact that for some reason, and I think that is a deal that is available uh, for this upcoming week. I, I'm not sure, but if it is, you know for sure I'm gonna be uh, sharing Target deals with you guys all through the through the week, cause um, I always upload uh, videos that have to do with Target because um, when it comes to Target and Walmart, most of us you know, have access to either one um, and stuff like that. But when it comes to like, you know, Publix, uh, Kroger and things like that, that's different. So I always make sure that I try to upload as many uh, deals available at Target as I possibly can. And I also upload uh, deals available at Walmart. So <clears throat> I upload all kinds of videos as you guys know I don't you know all kinds of different stores and stuff so if any of these deals are available for this upcoming week I will definitely uh, make sure I share those deals with you guys but this channel is also a coupon and diary for me to a point a lot of times what ends up happening is I do share a lot of deals with you guys all throughout the week I upload pretty constantly you know a couple of videos a day most of the time <clears throat> and uh, sometimes when it comes to and I'm also a very active couponer so and I have other things that I do so sometimes when it comes to my hauls by the time I want to upload them it's just either too late or you know I end up not doing it but this one I'm gonna make sure that I do upload it even if it is for myself to look back at because this is the way of um, you know when I do that I get to see my growth as a couponer mistakes I've made things that I wouldn't do anymore things that I <laughs> used to do you know things like that so the Pils the Pillsbury deal the frosting and the cake mix one of um, the cake mix was a dollar and twelve cents regular price the frosting was a dollar and fifty two cents regular price we have thirty one percent off uh, car wheel offers available for um, the frosting and for the cake mix <coughs> so I'm gonna show you the receipt super easy deal I'm not gonna do this like I usually would because uh, as I said before these are basically dead deals so you see it was 112 and 152. Um, let's see. The frosting after the car wheel offer was applied. It was a dollar and four cents. And the cake mix was 77 cents. So my subtotal was a dollar and 81 cents for both of them. And uh, my taxes were zero. 83 cents save. <coughs> for both of them, okay? 181 no taxes now for me the beans were a money maker I used uh, hold on I used three of these coupons right there okay this coupon expires the 27th of uh, November and this is the smart source let's see I don't know if you can see this more source 10 16 I don't know if you guys will be able to see that or not hmm. this 10 16 smart source right there right there sorry you can't see it so 
So, yeah. <coughs> ten, excuse me, ten sixteen smart source. I used three of those coupons. I have checkout fifty one uploaded on three separate devices. One of them is my account, my personal, you know, my account, and the other two are not my accounts. They, I don't live by myself, but I am the person who does most of the shopping here. Therefore, I have access to those two other accounts because nobody, nobody uses them. They did at the beginning and no more. So basically, here we go. Um, they were a dollar each. And using the application Checkout 51, basically, you can um, get uh five you know five dollars back for purchasing uh bush beans you could take advantage of the offer up to five you know five times and so i purchased six cans used three one dollar coupons that took off three dollars and because my total was six dollars for six cans that the you know minus the three dollars of uh, um, each coupon was a dollar off of two, so minus the coupons, um, I pay three dollars. I will show you the receipt. I pay three dollars and I uploaded my receipt using the application Checkout 51 and I got back uh, five dollars. So each time, and I did that on three devices, 18 cans total, six per device, so 18 cans completely free. Uh, made two dollars on one device, two dollars on another, and two dollars on another. So six dollars. Um, but if not, if you do it on just one device and you only purchase six cans, as far as I know, if you're still able to uh, purchase them for a dollar each can, <coughs> you will buy six cans of beans. Use three of the one dollar off of two coupons. Uh, pay three dollars at checkout time. Um, you should get back. Uh, five dollars using the application checkout 51 and then that means that that will be a two dollar money maker right there right and on top of that you send the application checkout if um i'm saving star sorry you guys it is literally 4 29 a.m i am super tired um so and i am sitting by this window and <coughs> because i have uh bronchitis is not helping you know the chill from outside is not helping it's making me cough so I, I apologize um so using the application saving star i think if you spend up to 12 dollars before that is before coupons if you spend up to 12 dollars they give you back three dollars and since i did the deal three times i hit the 12 dollars and um i still could have done it uh, again and maybe just needed a couple of more cans to get another three dollars <coughs> so all together for me the beans were a nine dollar money maker using checkout 51 and saving star now remember if you only take advantage of of the offer the maximum time amount of times that you can do it uh, which is five if you purchase six cans um, you will still have a two dollar money maker and then if you take advantage of the offer you know, on Saving Star, pay three dollars for spending twelve on bush beans. So nine dollar money maker here, a dollar and eighty one, I think, for the frosting and the cake mix. So hold on, what else? So the deal on the Tostitos and the Pepsi. That's one deal. So, if you buy Tostito chips, uh, 13 ounces on sale for $3, uh, regular price uh, $3.99. And if you buy Pepsi mini cans, 8 pack for $3.49, regular price, there, there is a 31% off car wheel offer for the chips and a 31% off um, car wheel offer for the Pepsi mini cans. And, <coughs> excuse me, using the application Checkout 51. They are giving you back a dollar for purchasing both items, if I'm not mistaken. And now this right here, um, I was able to find this offer on one of the devices. On the other two devices, I couldn't find this offer. So Ibotta is giving you back a dollar. But as I said before, I keep the three applications up to, you know, the three devices up to date. 
uh, same exact application um, <clears throat> basically used by the same you know I mean the same way and everything and um, for some reason um, this deal was only available on one of the devices so I bought a gave me one uh, at back a dollar so my total was three plus three forty nine uh, that was six dollars and forty nine cents minus ninety three cents. That was uh, one of the thirty one percent of car wheel offers. That was five fifty six minus one dollar and eight cents. Uh, that was the one for the car wheel offer for the Pepsi mini cans four dollars and forty eight cents. Um, <coughs> excuse me. That is how much I paid out of pocket. I believe. Let's see where's that receipt. Let me see. Hold on, I did that one. I'm going to show you the one for the beans. Hold on a second, please. You guys, let me... The last time I said the same thing, and I just totally forgot to show it to you guys. So, actually, I paid four eighty-two. That was my subtotal. Um, then I got back a dollar using the application Checkout 51, and I got back a dollar using the application um, Ibotta. <coughs> And on top of that, um, got back um, two cents using the application's um, Saving Star. Wait, one dollar with Ibotta, one dollar, check out 51, two cents because it was one percent off um, the Tostitos, um, the chips. So um, using Saving Star, they gave me back two cents. Um, but for me, every penny counts. So, um, so, let's see. This was my receipt. Seventeen cents taxes. And one dollar I bought it. I did not include it there. <coughs> this is the one for the beans. See, pay three dollars. Save 474. That's one. That's another. Because I had to do uh, purchase them individually on separate receipts. So, <clears throat> what other deal? The wet ones. So, the deal on the wet ones uh, buy two. Wet ones, hand wipes, canister singles uh, for $2.39 each. Um, I was able to find them for a dollar and 64 cents. No, two thirty nine dollars actually. After the car wheel offer for 31% off, um, they end up being a dollar and 64 cents. I'll show you the receipt also. Then uh, check out. Um, Ibotta, the application Ibotta is giving you back a dollar and fifty cents for purchasing um I think for purchasing two items. So my total was two dollars and thirty nine cents times two. That was four seventy eight minus the thirty one percent off. Um took off sixty nine cents. That was three dollars and twenty nine cents. That was um what I paid at the time of checkout. So minus the one dollar and fifty cents that I got back using the application Ibotta for purchasing both items. And, um, you know, after scanning them and uploading a picture of my receipt, a dollar and seventy nine cents for both, so eighty nine cents each. <clears throat> and I purchased them individually. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, I made a mistake and I purchased them individually. And then when I went to scan the the I, when I went to take a picture of the receipt, what I did is, you know, if you've ever used Ibotta, what I did was where it says that you could add a sesh, a se section of the receipt in case you have a long receipt. It gives you a plus sign and it says, you know, add a sesh, uh, section. So I just um when it came down to the to the bottom of this one, you know, of this one, then I just add it. You know, I clicked on that again, and I took a picture of the other receipt. And then when it was taking it off, it, the you know it was uh, 
<laughs> excuse me, uploading the receipt, it did it twice. So, and I got my money back. I was nervous about that. I said, oh my God, oh my God. I got my dollar and 50 cents back. Because that's really the only reason why I purchased them. And um, that's it. No, the Ritz. Okay, so the Ritz crackers. Um, basically, you buy two Ritz crackers on sale for $2.50 each. This is a Target. Remember, regularly priced at $2.69. There is a 31% off uh, car wheel offer available for Ritz crackers and toasted chips. Um, there is a $1.15 a one dollar and fifteen cents uh, cashback offer using the application checkout fifty one. So my total was two dollars and fifty cents times two. That was five dollars minus the sixty nine uh, cents that the car wheel offer took off three forty five. That is how much I paid on my time of checkout. I believe, <coughs> and I couldn't find that receipt. So on after that, I submitted my receipt. And uh, for to be able to get the one dollar and fifteen cents using checkout fifty one, so two dollars and thirty cents for both, one dollar and fifteen cents each, <clears throat> and that was it. That was it. So hold on. So remember that I did say the beans, where um, when you purchase six cans, and you use checkout fifty one. They are a $2 money maker because you pay for six cans after the three coupons, uh, $3. And you end up getting $5 back for the beans if you purchase six cans. So that immediate automatically makes them completely free because you're getting back $5 um, when you only pay three before taxes. So $2 money maker. And a freebie for me since I did the deal three times and then I took advantage of the offer using Saving Star, I did get back three dollars more. So that was a nine dollar money maker. And remember that for the Pillsbury and the cake mix and the <coughs> vanilla was a dollar eighty one uh, for both items. No taxes on that. The wet ones a dollar and seventy nine cents for both. And two dollars and thirty cents for the Ritz crackers. <coughs> Excuse me. So that was a total of five dollars and ninety cents minus nine dollars, which was the money maker right here. Um, that still left me with a three dollar and ten cent money maker. And uh, let's see. I don't remember how much the the Tostitos were. But I know that they were not more than $3. The Tostitos and the Pepsi, after everything, were not more than $3.10. So basically, hold on. I'm going to see if I could find it. If I could find my notes. The Tostitos, um, yeah, they were $2.48. So to $3.10, subtract, subtract the two... Um, <laughs> something and since I still had three dollars and ten cents uh, of a money maker minus the two dollars and some change for the Pepsi and the Tostitos all of this everything that you're looking at thanks to uh, car wheel offers thanks to um, checkout 51 thanks to saving star thanks to Ibotta thanks to manufacturers coupons was completely free so and still a couple of cents of money maker but of course you guys this is without including my taxes but remember on those I had no taxes on the let's see on the beans on the wet ones I had 10 cents each time so that was 20 cents worth of taxes on the bush beans I need to see right there <coughs> I had no taxes each time so so far we're at 20 cents worth of taxes okay plus 17 cents right here worth of taxes for the Tostitos and the Pepsi so that's 47 cents worth of taxes and the taxes for you know a couple of that's it so very good deal mostly almost uh, before taxes still a money maker and And after taxes, let's 
it must be less than a dollar. I just can't tell you because I can't find my um, my receipt for the Ritz. <coughs> no, I can't find my receipt for the... There's one receipt I can't find. It's the one for the Ritz, yes. So, these are the items that I got. And I think I did pretty good. 18 cans of bean for free. Before any... Well, after applications. And, uh... Nine dollar worth of um, nine dollar money maker, six dollars after checkout fifty one uh money maker for the beans, and uh nine dollar after using checkout fifty one and saving star um the cake mix ended up being completely free, and the uh, frosting thanks to the overage from the beans, so did the tostitos, the wet ones, the Ritz, the Pepsi uh completely free thanks to the overage and um that's it. So, thank you so much, and I'm going to leave it at that. Subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Thank you so much for your support. Remember, you guys, I did say I'm not sure if some of these deals are still available. You know, the prices are still available for this upcoming week. But I do know that the car wheel, I mean, the, <coughs> the rebates are still good. The one for the um, for the Ritz, the one for, uh, that's checkout fifty one, the one for the and the Tostitos and Pepsi that's checkout fifty one and Ibotta, but make sure that you know whether you have available on Ibotta or not because I did tell you what happened to me on two of my devices they do not have it. The Bush um, that actually uh, was available at the beginning of the week. I did that deal exactly what you're looking at the 18 cans and it reset it on Thursday um, <clears throat> and I did it again so think about it two times I got 18 cans and 18 cans yep so that's it bye bye you guys I hope you like this video and that's it <laughs>